So I finally came to realize that I'm probably the worst person when it comes to setting a schedule and following it because I always tell myself, you know what, maybe I should do a video today, maybe I should do a video here, but I never actually end up doing it and personally I still can't figure out why I'm so lazy and why I procrastinate so much but I really wanted to put out a video for you guys today and this is a 17 and 0 in four rounds on um, village and you guys are gonna notice a lot in this gameplay that I always come back to this place and I never really made a video um, talking about um, some of the more power positions I like to call them on certain maps so for example right here you see that I generally like to use this this corner right here because there's only two general directions that the enemy can come at you and that is either um, from the left with the bridge right there and directly towards this b-bomb right here is where you're gonna encounter a lot of people so right here just really gives me a chance to get a lot of cover in and I can just look back and forth and see if anybody's coming towards the bomb or if anybody's flanking me and just pick up a bunch of kills and as you guys can notice my teammates pretty much dropped so as I shot off I knew everybody was gonna try and rush me so that's why I'm just waiting out and seeing if I can get as many kills as possible and I ended up picking up the ace and I'm sorry I probably just ran it on a little bit about this gameplay but I really wanted to talk about what's going on with Search and Destroy because every time they try and add something in or they do something new, I kind of like to let you guys know considering this is primarily or it is primarily a Search and Destroy oriented channel. Um, some of you guys may know, some of you guys may not know. Um, they finally gave us Ground War Search and Destroy. I mean, we've always been asking for the whole idea of a 9v9 Search and Destroy just because we're kind of getting a little bit tired of having just 6v6. We want to have um, what the Domination and the TDM players have is just that opportunity to get a lot more kills. And with that being said, that opportunity for a lot more kills also brings a higher standard for Grand War gameplays. So, you guys are watching right now 17-0. I'm not really sure if I would consider like a 17-0 or like a 15-0 really a Grand War kind of gameplay. Because just because you can kind of get those gameplays in two rounds. So, I'm not really sure how the whole standards are going to go towards... Um, playing in Grand War playlist, but I do know that me personally, I'm going to have to up my standards up from getting gameplays in that game mode, so you'll never see me post like a 14-0 in Grand War just because it doesn't really seem overall that impressive when you could get like 30 kills in that gameplay. Um, so anyway, I'm going to be trying to play as much of that as I can. The really bad thing about it is now that they have three playlists in Grand War, and um, I don't really play a whole lot of Grand War, so I don't know if they have Drop Zone in there, so there could be three or four different playlists in Grand War. So that means you're always going to get Domination. You're always going to get TDM. You're never really going to get that soul search and destroy which is 9v9 and that's something I know some of us have been asking for just because we really want that change and I think it'll be a, a cool change to it but I do see myself going back and just constantly playing 6v6 search and destroy because I'm just going to get very tired, very aggravated of just going into Grand War and just having to um, play all these stupid maps, play all these stupid game modes. So you're probably going to see more regular Search and Destroy gameplay from me just because waiting that stuff out is just going to be way too time consuming and then probably when I get in the game I'll probably choke because uh, choking gameplays is something I like to do a whole lot. Um, but yeah, as far as this whole Grand War Search and Destroy thing goes, um, I think it's kind of cool. I think it's a little bit of a, um, a good change because like I said, we're going to be uploading a lot more higher scoring gameplays. And that's one thing that um, a lot of people get turned away from when they watch Search and Destroy gameplay is that, oh, well, you only got 15 kills, or oh, well, you only got 16 kills. And that's primarily because people don't understand that there's not very many kills available in that game mode. So it's going to be kind of interesting to see how um, YouTube is going to play out with uh, having these big ass scoring search and destroy games but anyway let me know what you guys think about this whole idea of grand war and search and destroy uh, personally i think it's a little bit cool i'm gonna have to venture it and test it out a little bit further and then i'll give you guys my opinion on it but be sure to leave your thoughts and opinions on it in the comment section and i will talk to you guys in my next video if you guys want to check out two of my previous videos you can just click on the screen um, where it says click it so anyway i'll talk to you guys next time